Whether you've used more than one ball of wool or you've worked in stripes, you're likely to have a few loose lengths of yarn hanging from your work when you finish knitting. These could be used to sew up seams if you're making a garment or an accessory, but the rest need to be secured discreetly at the back. Let's start by weaving in the ends of this coloured stripe. Begin by threading a blunt needle with the coloured end and then we're going to take the same colour stitches and we're going to weave the sewing needle through those stitches. Just go a few stitches deep away from the edge, pull it all the way through and then skip that last one and weave your way back through just a couple of stitches on the back. Just make sure that you haven't pulled it too tight, that it's not going to affect the, the tension and then you can snip that end off. And you shouldn't be able to see it from the right side. If you have an end that is a little bit short, you can thread the needle through the stitches first. Then thread the wool into the needle. And pull it through. And then to return, skip over that last stitch there back under these ones and thread the needle again and pull that through making sure that you haven't affected the tension too much that it's not too tight you can't see it from the right side and then you can trim that away You will also have other ends that may need to be sewn in along um, a cast on edge or a cast off edge or up the side. It's usually better to sew a garment together first before sewing in the ends. But when you're ready, take a blunt needle, thread it with the end and then work up the side slightly to the back of the work and just catch the stitches in one direction, pull it but not too tight and then return, miss the first stitch here and return back along that way. Check that it's not pulled too tight, check that you can't really see it from the right side and then you can snip the yarn. If you need to sew your edge in along uh, a cast off or cast on edge, the principle is exactly the same. Thread the needle and just in from the back of your work, hide the stitches so that they can't be seen. Go through a few of these in one direction and then skipping the first stitch, just go back along through, catching a few lines along the way. Check that you've not pulled it too tight. Keep stretching it out as you're working. Check that you can't really see it from the front. And then you can snip that end off. <laughs> 